So what's the nigga name? The the King AK forty seven nigga. I'm gonna say your name right now, right? I'm gonna, I'm gonna say your name. So I, I'm because I'm I'm kind of confused, right? Like last time I went live, we had almost nine thousand people in the building. About five hundred of them people was your people typing your name inside my comment section. Niggas then seen your name. Your name keep popping up under my name, like dogs. The difference between me and you is when I go outside, right? Not only when I go outside. If, if you go down the list of the niggas that I was raised by, I was raised by legends in the game. When you see me in photos, if you know who them niggas, if you know the niggas that come from where I come from and the niggas that I ran with, they're legendary niggas. Name one person, name one OG that's universe, that's known throughout your state that everybody know that they could, that, that they could connect you to. See, I'm not the nigga that sit up there and, and name myself, let me show you, you a bird ass nigga. You named yourself after AK, which you really still, in, uh, and you trying to put yourself up, uh, up under um, uh, 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 academics. You are a a AK, AK. You're trying to creep up under his algorithm, up under his flow, and copy my whole style at the same time. You done mimic me, copy me, mimic me, copy me, to the point to where that you sit up there and your videos sounded just like me. If you make a video before me, look, 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 he said, but I know, nigga, you done studied me so much, you actually t t speaking with my speaking points, my nigga. Look, I made the video first. No, nigga, you studying me. I will never, ever, ever put a teardrop on my face. That's bird shit. I will never put tattoos on my face, nigga. I was a criminal. When I was in the goddamn, in, in, in the lineup for them homicides and attempted murders, like when I shot Max, boom, boom, boom. Shout out to Max. I don't want to smoke. When I was in that lineup, I was trying to blend in and look like the baby, the little curly hair boy. Nigga, you ain't never been in a lineup. And these are the niggas that y'all be following. Nigga ain't never been in the lineup. Fuck all the joke. We ain't even got a joke. We ain't got to crack jokes. So nigga, I'll kill you with the truth. You ain't never been in a homicide lineup, nigga. You ain't never been locked up or, or, or been around bank robbers. Nigga, I was, raised, I was raised by bank robbers. My big homies used to ride with bodies in the trunk. With me sitting in the passenger seat. With guns bigger than my, with guns bigger than my goddamn stomach. You don't know nothing about that. Y'all niggas get on the internet with these colorful names, bottom guns from the from the pawn shop in y'all neighborhoods to show them on camera. Nigga, every, when I walked outside with them guns on my waist in my earlier days, son, there was nothing but a police car and a jail cell waiting for me. My enemies is notorious, nigga. I got notorious enemies, legendary enemies. Shout out to Pistol Pete. Legendary enemies. And you niggas get on the internet with tattoos on your face and try to make you seem like you somebody. You're nobody. Nobody. I got big homies that's legendary. Niggas in the grave and they scared, they still scared to talk about his name. I'm the only one trying to keep B.O. name alive. Rest in peace to my big brother. I'm the only one. You niggas don't see no documentaries out on him. After all these years, niggas ain't throwing no barbecues in his name and none of the rest of that. That's one of because niggas was scared. My, my, my nigga was, was so different. My nigga was so different that some niggas be celebrating the fact that he gone. They happy he gone. Jealous ass, envious ass niggas. Where I come from, the niggas that raised me, Oh, fuck all the jokes is, and you got, oh, you got this in your ass, and that, oh, yeah, all that, all that shit, uh, all the shit that y'all say about me, well, for some reason, it's something about this vice on Campbell that y'all niggas got to swagger jack me. I don't get it. What is it about my style that's all right? Because you not like me, and y'all try to figure out, like, damn, how this nigga go cry, and then turn around and have 5,000 people watching him in the live, 4,000, consistent. How? Because I know how to be me. And people love me for being me, but they love you for you being me too. <laughs> Hit them in the head. They love you because you want to be me. You mimic me. You copy me. Like, damn. See the nigga put a video up. Niggas tag me to this video. Look at this, this AK-47 nigga. Look at him. Nigga in the jewelry store 
<clears throat> trying on white juries, trying on a chain just like mine. I got these rappers stuff. I, yo, I, I stopped wearing the two chains, the, the two white chains. I stopped wearing it because everybody started wearing two white chains. Then when I stopped, niggas stopped. Jim Jones and Mano, I guess they started being different. Them niggas putting 15 chains on now. Looking stupid. That shit looks stupid. Corny ass nigga got tattoos on y'all faces. Y'all been taking these niggas serious, man. Taking these. I guarantee you, if you ask any gangster, ask T Mac, you ask any gangster in a shootout, who would they want standing by their side? Me or AK 47? Watch what the streets say. The streets, not the internet. Watch what the streets say. Watch what the streets say. Niggas won't want you. Nigga, y'all niggas want not to survive. I was laughing at my sister corny ass husband. <laughs> Shout out to Orrin Pullins. I'm laughing at this nigga. I'm at my sister mansion, right? So when I'm at my sister mansion, I'm talking to my, my brother-in-law. He's sitting up there talking about, yeah, what would you have done in a situation with a, with, with, with a, with a white guy shot at the supermarket? I said, nigga, I'd have been busting my gun. He said, no, you wouldn't. I said, you think I'm going to let a nigga come up in the supermarket because he got a bigger gun I'm going to let him shoot me? Like, nigga, I've been through situations like that my whole life. I done been through shootouts my whole life. So a nigga rolling up on a supermarket just gunning people down while he clapping somebody, I'm going to be clapping him. Nah, I would have ran. Yeah, you would have ran because you ain't battle tested. Then I'm looking at the bird ass nigga because he got a gun on his waist. He got a legal gun on his waist talking about he going to run. He got a legal gun on his waist. You going to run? You legally can stand your ground and kill somebody. You talking about you going to run? Nah, he had a big gun. So nigga, you should be carrying a big gun. Bird. <laughs>